Bristol Community College, Mathematics with Dan Avedikian, Math 011, Arithmetic, Section 2.11, Problem 15. This is Section 2.11, Problem 15. It says, a carpenter makes a stack of 30 sheets of plywood. If each sheet is 5 eighths of an inch thick, how high is the stack? So I have 30 sheets in the stack of plywood, each one is 5 eighths of an inch thick. So we can multiply the number of sheets times the thickness of each sheet, and that will give us the answer. 30 sheets, each one is 5 eighths of an inch thick. So to multiply fractions, I really need to multiply top times top, bottom times bottom. The 30 does not have a numerator and a denominator, but I can fix that. Let's write 30 over 1 times 5 over 8. Now I have a top and a bottom for each fraction. I can multiply the tops. 30 times 5 get 150. 1 times 8 get 8. It'll reduce nicely. Um, or, if you notice, you can pre-reduce a little bit. The 5 doesn't really work. The, the 5 and the 30 reduce, but they're both on the top. You can't pre-reduce those. One has to be on the top and one on the bottom. But the 8 and the 30 can at least both be cut in half. 2 goes into 8 4 times, right? 2 goes into 8 4 times. 2 goes into 30 15 times. So now I can multiply top times top, bottom times bottom. So the top, so numerator is multiplied together 5 times 15. I know that's 75. You may or may not recognize it. If you don't, just take a second to go off to the side and do all the multiplication. 5 times 15. Those are my numerators multiplied together. 5 times 5 is 25. Carry the 2. 5 times 1 is 5. 5 plus 2 more is 7. So it, sure enough, it is 75. Multiply the denominators, 1 times 4. 1 times 4 is 4. So the answer, how high is the stack of plywood, is 75 over 4. And that is the answer. But for a problem like this, it would look much nicer if we converted the 75 over 4 to a mixed number, which is easy enough to do. So in order to do that, when you have an improper fraction like this, the numerator is larger than the denominator, what you want to do is divide the denominator into the numerator. In this case, 4 will divide into 75 how many times? 4 goes into 7 only once. 1 times 4 is 4. Subtract 7 minus 4 is 3. Bring down the next digit. The 5 comes down next to the 3. Now divide 4 into 35. 9 is a little too big. It would be 36, so I'll have to go with 8. 8 will work. 8 times 4 is 32. Subtract 35 minus 32 is 3. So when we do this, the remainder of 3 is the numerator for my mixed number. And the number that was the denominator remains the denominator. So 75 over 4 is the correct answer, but it's really not in the nicest form. It's also equivalent to 18 and 3 quarters. So if you have a stack of plywood, there's 30 sheets in the stack. Each stack is 5 eighths of an inch thick. The height of that pile of plywood is 18 and 3 quarter inches.